What's up, Magic Mob? Today, we're going to make and style a three tier tray out of these items that I found at my local Goodwill. All right, so before we get started with putting the tray together, the first thing that I'm going to do is clean the silver. Uh, the items that I found had a little bit of tarnish on them. So I am cleaning them by making a solution of about a tablespoon of baking powder, a tablespoon of iodized salt, and then you also have to layer your pan with aluminum foil. All you do is put your silver into the pan Take a light scrub brush and then just begin to scrub off the tarnish and it will come right off. As you can see, this tray here started off pretty much uh, like a smoky gray. Uh, I'm just going to scrub and scrub and scrub a little bit more until I get it as clean as possible. All right, so what you're going to need for this project are three trays, uh, all three different sizes. So you're going to go large, medium, small. So at my local Goodwill, I just found a couple of trays uh, that were alike, and then I just made sure that they fit inside each other just like that. And now to connect these together, I'm going to be using a mixture of cups and candelabras. Um, or candlestick holders and just different things for this project. I'm going to use e6000 which is a heavy-duty adhesive So I'm just going to put a bead of e6000 um, between each layer and stick it together When putting your layers together, you do want to make sure that they're even. So one thing that I suggest is getting in front of your project so that you can get a better look at it to make sure that everything is lined up perfectly. And one more tip guys, the E6000 can get pretty messy. So make sure you have some type of tray nearby because it normally tends to continue to ooze out once you begin to squeeze it. So make sure that you have a tray so that you can avoid any mess. And 
after a few dry hours of drying, there it is. Very, very simple to do. Just find some items that you like that work well together for you. And I did not mind mixing and matching uh, my metals. I thought they looked really cool together. So you can be creative and find things that you like and go ahead and make you a tray. So now on to the styling. Just a tip for styling, you wanna use uh, some greenery. You see I have some cups here because this is gonna be next to my coffee pot. And then I found other little things like candles and some uh, artificial fruit. And I also put a couple of pumpkins up there because we are going into the fall season. But again, this is completely up to you. Whatever you like to style, this is really good because you can decorate it for every change of holiday or every season you can change it. So I thought this looked really nice. watching if you enjoyed this video then go ahead and give it a thumbs up also if you enjoy diy home decor and room transformations then go ahead and consider subscribing to this channel and hitting the notification bell so you'll be notified every time i upload a video so thank you guys again and i will see you on the next one